As you enjoy Lake Champlain and other Vermont waters in the summer, remember they're home to all kinds of life, including cyanobacteria. Often called blue-green algae, cyanobacteria can be toxic. So if you see it, stay away. But do you know what it most commonly looks like? Here are a few clues. If you see anything that sticks to rocks, plants, or the bottom of the lake, or if you can pick it up with a stick, it's not cyanobacteria. If you can see that it has separate leaves, it's not cyanobacteria either. It may be duckweed or another plant with small leaves that can look like cyanobacteria from a distance. If it's yellowish and can be seen on the ground as well as the water during spring to midsummer, it's likely pollen rather than cyanobacteria. So what do cyanobacteria look like? They typically look like small, pinhead-sized particles. Under the right conditions, cyanobacteria may collect in a layer on the surface of the water. That's called a bloom. It can look like pea soup or a blue-green paint spill on the water's surface. The water could also look murky, a brownish-green, milky-green, or blue. If you think you've spotted cyanobacteria or you're not sure, don't wade, swim, or boat in the area, or let pets or livestock swim in the water, drink the water, or lick their fur after swimming. Do contact the beach manager or town office and email the Department of Health at bloomalert at vermont.gov. If you've already come into contact with the water, rinse yourself and your pet after swimming, and contact your healthcare provider if you feel sick. Remember, when in doubt, it's best to stay out. If we learn to recognize cyanobacteria, we can all enjoy Vermont's beautiful lakes and ponds safely. To learn more about tracking cyanobacteria, visit healthvermont.gov. To volunteer to help monitor Vermont waters, visit lakechamplaincommittee.org.